Yeah. Boom. <laughs> jingle bells, bitch. Hey. Jingle, jingle bells, bitch. All right, so we're going to Soul Food Bistro. Uh, Pull it down some. I don't. So like, no. Oh, oh. yeah. You got <laughs> Right, right there. Okay, what's good, y'all? Okay. A minute in, so we gotta cut all that. All right, we're going to Soul Food Bistro yeah. for the first time. Oh, well, for their for the first time, this is not my first time. And we're gonna give it a try and see what we like and what we don't like and how we feel. Oh, uh, here I go. Damn. All right. Let's see how that come away. We'll see y'all in the car. Okay. <laughs> we here. About to go eat. I'm hungry. Okay, shit. Y'all hungry? Let me see. We ready. Okay, we ready to go. Two. Yeah, it's real nippy out here, man. It's cold in Florida. It's supposed to be like 20 something degrees though. It's supposed to drop. to play back a clip. <laughs> Yeah, so we're gonna take a little brief intermission. We'll be right back. Talk to y'all in a little bit. What about that cocktail sauce? No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yes, baby. You're a nice person. Okay. Thank you so much. Hey, we wanna. Boom. Boom. How are everybody feeling? Delicious, right? Right, 10 out of 10. I don't know why the, why the heck Everything this like, guy forgot to tell us about this place. Well, it is the first place that we are reviewing, so. And it's bomb. Like, I don't know. Look, hey, yo, look, now you trying to be funny? I'm going to go into detail. Give me one second. We're gonna, we we got to finish. This is just a brief intermission. You see, we still got a lot of shit going on here. Busting said, it down, bro. He said, let me finish. I'm not about to be recording. <laughs> let me finish. I can't complain. Right. It is All right. good. It's good. A1. I'm like, wait, I'm just standing there. Like. <sighs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah they're going to break out dancing in the middle of the street, though. Rick Valley. It's cold as fuck outside. Yeah, I need my mask. Boom. So we're gonna just do a quick. You could drive. I'm just gonna, you know, we're just gonna talk a little bit. Food was excellent. I really enjoyed that meal, especially because it's like, what is it, Christmas Eve? That was an excellent Christmas Eve meal, man. Yeah. I really feel like I went home and got. I really feel like I went home and got a, like a, a family plate and. I, I seen my aunt that I, I, I grew up with. Yeah, I tell you. And she just like hugged me up and told me I was a good person. And I've been doing good in life. 
and she's proud of me. Yeah, man. And I'm just happy, man. You <laughs> have the greatest customer service. What's her name again? Tamla. Tam Tangy? I thought it was. It's so the T. That's fucked up. We don't remember her name. Damn. But you, she if was you a go, you're going to know who she you is. You're going to know who she is. Yeah, you're no, gonna know she's who she awesome is. as fuck. Because you're going to be an amazing person. You're going to be so sweet. You're yep. a great person. Yep. And you can tell she there. She she, she lights up the energy there. The, yes, the energy is going to be high. The vibration is going to be loud. It was really so. excellent. I really enjoyed the uh, meal and the food. Didn't and, have to. Uh, get nothing she was on it bro i was talking about even when we wanted extra food we thought we was gonna have to get it back in line or stuff and she was like no i can take care of that money so how did y'all how did y'all feel about i remember y'all were saying about the pricing because you know y'all usually y always paying for two that's why we kept going back to get more food so normally when we get food we always expect to pay like between 25 and 30 dollars for the both of us and we were able to do that. We spent thirty dollars, and we got way more food than we would normally get. Like we had extra sides and extra meats. So, child, yeah, the, if you going to, you know, what I'm saying you ain't trying to spend a lot of money. And portion wise was really good. I was about like, to say the extra side of fish that we got was only like gave, three, was less than three dollars, and they gave us two, two big, ass pieces, big pieces. They show you love, man, and, yeah. and even with the sides, the other sides, like they they, they give you like a, a good a good portion amount, like you was at the crib. Mm -hmm. like you trying to get a little like you know, you what I'm auntie food. making you a plate. She wants you to make sure you're eating good. Yeah, they're they not trying to make money, just make money. They want to make sure y'all eating good. Yeah, giving good vibes and good energy. Great experience. You know so for the most part, we can say that the customer service was really good. Excellent. The food was good. It didn't Excellent. take long to get our food nope. at all. Um, but everybody was very welcoming. Every, yes, everybody in. was extremely welcoming. Okay. But we know sometimes, you know, there are downsides. Um, the only downside I would say that I experienced was the cornbread was a little burnt in the bottom. Um, and the yams was, you could have, they could have did a little better with the yams. However, with the customer service and everything else i like i wouldn't even care i would go back and i would and, and i would say that it's hard to find really good yams at a at, a, at restaurants so their yams are had are like better than a lot of the restaurant yams i've had but we were had we had a discussion like if it feels like they stretched it like they might have add water yeah, they was like, running low in the back like like yeah. you know it wasn't like you know we used to that sticky they yams. wanted everybody to get some syrupy yams, yeah. we, and it was like it was like a, the, the sauce in the yams was a little bit watery, but they, it was still good flavorfully. Yeah, yeah. But oh, you could right. tell it was like out the can. It wasn't like you know, but yams is hard to get at places. But the cornbread was burnt, and yeah. we had a lady in front of us down there by the slap. Yeah, <laughs> somebody, they're trying but to get I would say, cornbread. although it was burnt at the bottom, it wasn't like hard. You know what I'm saying? Like it was still like. Fluffy and soft. It they just, left it in a little bit. Too yeah, long. they just left it in a little bit too long. Maybe a few seconds, and they could have saved. My themselves. downfall was I got rice. Um, the rice was good. It was cooked fine. I just think that they should have seasoned the rice itself. I had gravy on top of the rice, and um, that definitely helped. But if we're gonna do that, then you gotta drown, drown my rice and gravy down there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So. I would say maybe season the rice. Um, and then the weirdest thing happened with my greens, bro. Like when I first got them, the greens was the first thing I tried. You know what I'm saying? They, they were slap. Like I was going back to them and everything and I let them sit for a while because I got I had ordered a side of mac and cheese and everything. When it came back, it was like the flavor left or something. Now, I know my taste buds might have been, you know what I'm saying? But that was just weird. Like maybe like once I got to the bottom of my greens, they just were, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It wasn't the taste wasn't bad. It just was. It was like it was faint. Like it was like it was like disappearing. We <laughs> might have over ate the green. Hit a flavor. Yeah, but man. but man, it's mad. I would say go try for yourself. And with all the food that we had, I'm surprised that I didn't like overeat or no. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I still feel good. I don't feel. And too we all sluggish. got leftovers. Yeah. yeah, we got leftovers. So we're gonna be eating that later Man. tonight, and that's a snack. Mm -hmm. So, what y'all? This was if, a good pick. If y'all would rate it, um, how are we gonna rate these foods? We could do stars or out of ten. I or, think out of ten is easier. Okay. Than five stars. Okay. But five stars might be a little bit more vague here and a little bit easier too. So let's do both. 
Okay, so stars, five out of five stars, what would you everybody give them? Four and a half. Four and a half? What'd you say, Kelly? I would say four and four. I give so my, say four? I give them a strong four. Me, I say, I haven't, I've been there before, and normally I would say on a normal basis they're four, but the customer service today was just exceptional, so I'm just gonna say, because of the custom, customer service, I'm gonna have to go with four and a half too. Like, it was just really exceptional. So out of like, out of uh, so on the basis of one to ten, or zero to ten, what would you put it on the scale there? No halves. Yeah, no I would numbers. just say nine. 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 I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go nine too. I'm gonna go nine too. Uh, so y'all go check out. Potter's so they house. raised with a nine and a four point five star rating. Boom. Put it on the screen. Boom. So, uh, yeah. Uh, what was that? Potter's House, Soul Food Bistro. Yeah, Shout out to y'all. Shout out to y'all. Great customer yeah. service in Jacksonville. Wait a minute, which street Regency. is it on? We gonna we put it at the bottom because it's two We went to the Regency them. location. Okay, yeah. So okay. we go to the Regency location there, the Regency Mall. Yeah, yeah. That's that's the one to go to. That's the one we went to, and that's the one we tried out. Maybe we'll try the other one out in uh, in the future. Yeah. But, Loved it. But it shout out to y'all. Really nice okay. and really good customer service. Keep up the good work, you guys. Even the cashiers, everybody. Happy holidays. Shout out to y'all.